guys welcome back today I have the new sensational collection to review for you guys this is their vice collection and I'm pretty sure some of you guys have seen it if you are on social media you probably seen it already but this is their vice guys as soon as we got it in the majority of it sold out so I was kind of waiting for them to come back in before I reviewed it so that way you guys have a chance to go purchase once the review goes up so hopefully by the time this review is up <laughs> they're in stock for you guys to purchase but anyway the first one I have here is vice you unit one so I have vice unit two and three coming up next so stay tuned for that but like I said this one is vice unit one and I have her in the color chunky highlight 27 so pretty it looks like uh it's more like a number four I would say mixed in with um the 27 highlight so I'm loving the color I'm loving the shade so far the hair is really really big now let me show you the stock card before I put it down this is what the stock card looks like this is it and let me see if there's any picture on the inside it's the same picture on the inside but anyway before I get into it okay guys this is not even all the hair to the front let me pull all the hair to the front so you can see this is all the hair to the front okay so you can tell and I did not finger comb it I did not fluff it out or anything like that I just left it as is straight out of the box because look at this look how big this is already so I didn't want to do too much I didn't want it to grow because normally once you have curly hair like this and you start finger combing it and stuff like that it does grow on you it gets bigger so I just left some to the back and just pulled a little bit forward I think it looks better that way let me know what you guys think let me know what you think I think it looks better this way just to you know just have a little bit in front instead of all or everything to the front is just too much but anyway guys let's get into the construction and everything like that so first of all this is a HD transparent lace wig now the lace is not as clear or white as you know they normally come but it is a um, HD transparent lace wig I didn't add any um, lace and spray to this one because the way I saw it straight out of the box, like I said, it doesn't look as white and chalky. So I was like, you know what, maybe I could pull it off. But I still had to go in with some powder, like, you know, around the hairline a little bit just to blend it in because it is a little bit too light for me. But I didn't mind going in with the powder, however. But anyway, it comes with natural baby hairs, so you can use that if you want to. It also comes with a pre-plucked hairline, and it says here that it's a deeper hairline, meaning that you have a little bit of space, maybe half an inch of lace up front that you can get to tweeze the hairline so the tracks don't start all the way to the front. The tracks don't start right where the baby hairs end. Okay, you have a little bit of space, so you can have so much of a natural hairline, so you can pull the wig back if you need to okay so that's what it means by a uh, um, deeper hairline also it's a five inch deep lace part I just added powder to it the parting space was super duper clear straight out the box so you don't have to worry about tweezing or anything like that it looks really natural straight out the box the next thing I want to talk about is the cap construction no it's a standard cap construction where you get two combs up front one at the back the adjustable straps it's a stretchable mesh net material cap so I would definitely say it's big head friendly because it does stretch a lot and it feels really comfortable but guys just feeling the cap construction feeling it looking at it you can tell that the quality is not that great um, the style is okay you know but the quality of the cap is really not that great so keep that in mind you wouldn't get your high class or should I say top class cap construction from sensational with this collection you wouldn't get it okay and I took all of them out of the box all the rest that I have to review for today and they are vice collection as well and yeah they don't feel the quality don't feel that great okay let me just say that but <laughs> the hair itself like I said I can't really comment on the texture so much I mean it feels really soft so far but I can't really comment on how like if it's shedding or tangling with this one in particular because of how the style is and I didn't go in and finger comb it and stuff like that but once I start reviewing the other two which is like straight and wavy I will get to you know really feel on the, tex on the texture and see how it is see if it's gonna shed or anything like that but anyway guys Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you think about this first Vice Unit 1. Let me know if you've purchased any of them before. Well, I say this because it's been out for 
a couple days now, a week, about a week, close to a week now. So yeah, um, let me know if you've purchased any of it, if you got it already, if you like it, or if you have any plans on purchasing it. But anyway, the link would be in the description box down below just in case you want to do that. It comes in other colors. I'll leave that link in the description box down there as well. But comment down below, let me know what you think, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.